Could a baseball bat be the key to fame in the finals? Join me in a whirlwind of tournament gameplay that'll leave you at the edge of your seat. The finals is no ordinary game. It's a futuristic game show where the environment is yours to destroy. Shape your unique strategy in this first person shooter and climb your way to the top. Now I've played both playtests and the game keeps on getting better and better. Closed Beta 2 has new weapons, new game modes, and a world event that fires a laser at campers standing still. I think they should make their playtest an open one because there are plenty of people who are eagerly waiting to play. I was there too, I get it. It took me a week to get my beta key and I was molding every minute. Now that I finally got access, I can confidently say that this game has a ton of potential. Embark Studios implemented multiple hotfixes over the playtest period. One was absolutely necessary. Comment below if you remember day one, the cloak of deafness. <clears throat> I mean, invisibility. In any case, betas are bound to have bugs and I truly admire the developers' responsiveness and quick fixes. The team's dedication gives me confidence in the future of the finals, so gear up for its launch date later this year. Now, remember my previous video where we discussed the light, medium, and heavy builds? Well, customization is king here. The heavy build allows you to choose charge and slam, goo gun, or the mesh shield. The medium build can opt for healing, guardian turret, or recon senses, and the light build may select a dash, invisibility, or a grappling hook. The choice is yours. Now, many Discord critics claim that the light build is too weak. Some even call it a glass cannon. Well, today we're proving them wrong as we dive into the light build. Watch me cut through the competition with my slash and dash baseball bat strategy. You'll see gameplay from the finals close beta 2, which was live from June 14th to the 21st, exclusively on Steam. However, don't fret, my console companions. The finals is coming to PS5 and Xbox. So to stay in the loop on everything the finals, get subscribed. play as the retros have just started a cash out. for the kingfish.
it left. Wow, that's quite the cash out from the ultra rares. New vaults. Our contestants better not leave those unattended for too long. Retros are back, opening Vault 3. Okay, there's a new event coming up in the round for our contestants. With an iron fin, the Kingfisher cutting into Vault 4. Contestants need to hurry up. One minute left. We'll need to try again. Teamwork. isn't it? The arena looks like it's fresh off the showroom floor. All ready for our contestants to take it out for a test drive. The tough shells are busy wriggling into Vault 1. I hate to see it.
force the steamrollers have started a cash out we're in for an overtime showdown folks a priceless performance in the arena as the ultra rares have started a cash out opportunity awaits for our contestants as we're heading into overtime Shells are now just a single tough shell. One contestant left. The powerhouses will need to reboot. Team wiped. The contestants did a real demolition job on them. We're down to the last 30 seconds. Which team will triumph? Contestants should keep their eyes out for moving platforms and anything hitching a ride on them, like a cash box. Step up on 
unlocking Vault 1. And with that encounter, we've got our first elimination. It's a test of nerves and skill from here. Last guy. The ultra rares are looking to make a name for themselves. First cash out started. Stairs. I was stairs. The ultra rares land the first cash out. Now that's something you don't see very often, Scotty. Exactly what I was thinking. Resume my body. Left for the steamrollers.
He's hurt. He's going for the res. Say press. The arena is transforming into a physics system. Charging for cash out speed. This way. left for the ultra rares. Rolling all the way to the top, the Steamrollers won that final round. Congratulations to our rising star!